Ja, Servus. Grüße und herzlich willkommen zur heutigen Medienrunde mit Joschko Guardiol, unserem Neuzugang, der bis 2026 bei uns unterschrieben hat, die Rücknummer 32 trägt und bei uns im Medienteam als derjenige gilt, der immer mit einem Grinsen auf dem Gesicht durch die Gegend läuft. Äh, warum das so ist, könnt ihr ihn ja gleich mal selber fragen. Ich würde euch bitten, das auf Englisch zu machen. Deutsch, da arbeiten wir noch dran. Eure Fragen bitte. Genau, Danny haben wir das Mikro. Das ist ja nett. He's gonna have it in English. In English? Yeah. yeah. All right. Hi, Josko. Um, um, Martin, my name. Um, uh, welcome at Leipzig. Um, tell us um, something about your first impressions uh, of the club, of the facility, um, of your new teammates and the work with the group and uh, the new coach. Yeah, hi guys. Uh, before uh, everything, uh, I would like to start with my teammates. Uh, for the first time, that's my first week here, and I like them a lot, especially uh, on the training sessions because uh, I like this mentality. Everyone, everyone is giving 100 percent, and there is no time for, uh, I would say, uh, easy going. So there is a only way to success. That's all. Yeah. Hello, Christen. Sky. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Welcome. Thank you. Um, yeah. Why did you choose uh, Leipzig? Yeah, I know. Uh, I know that you're gonna ask me that. Uh, well, uh, to be honest, uh, I think that Leipzig is a great club for the young players like me. And also, uh, Leipzig is playing uh, every every year a Champions League. That means a lot for, for me as a young player. And Dani, I talked to him a lot before before I made the decision to, to sign for Leipzig. Yeah. Oliver Hartmann from Kicker. You made your decision uh, one year before and then uh spend one more year in Zagreb. Um, was it the right step now? Are you now ready for the Bundesliga? To be honest, actually, I don't know why am I ready. <laughs> But uh, yeah, it's not easy, uh, to be honest, because uh, we are going very hard, training very hard uh, at the training sessions. Uh, I need this year in, in Dinamo Zagreb. Uh, It helps me a lot. So finally, there is a. Finally, I'm here, and I'm trying to. To to prepare myself for for, for the Bundesliga and and gives everything to to improve myself. Yeah. Niklas Heising from the Bild. Hi, Josko. Welcome uh, to Leipzig. So, um, from a quality of of the players, I mean. Uh, you have now had a week uh, training with the Leipzig players. I mean, talk about the difference in, in quality between uh, the Croatian league and your new teammates in Leipzig. I mean, is it a tough adjustment for you or was it all just easy going from the beginning? Yeah, you're right. That's my first week here. And to be honest, it's not easy. Uh, actually, I can compare uh, players from Zagreb, actually players from Croatia with with these players from from Bundesliga because my opinion about Bundesliga that is maybe the the strongest league in in the world so there is no time for for easy going as i said uh, i just need to be 100% on every training and that's all yeah Martin Henke noch mal Abby Life MZ um, Josko, um, uh, Leipzig has a unique style of play, um, the RB Leipzig style, um, which is a lot of uh, a lot of to do with uh, uh, counter pressing and counter attacking in a very fast mo uh, mode. Um, are you familiar with it, or is it completely new for you? Um, does it suit you? Fits you? And um, how far um, you are in training um, to adopt to that style of play? Yeah, it's a, uh, it's completely completely new for me uh, because in Dinamo Zagreb I used to play like a central defender off left back and 
uh, we had the ball all the time, so it was easy for us. And I'm gonna need to take some extra time to adapt for that. Uh, honestly, maybe one month, two months, three months. Actually, I don't know, but uh, I'm trying to do my best and uh, to do as quick as I can. And that's all. Oliver Hartmann from Kicker. Um, can you describe your experience from the European Championship? Was it for you on this competition, a big school? Yeah, yeah of course. Uh, it was a big step for me, especially for this, for the young players like like me. Uh, you know, I'm I was, and I'm still 19 years old. And uh, actually, I played every match. Uh, before the national team, I spent maybe one week with a team for uh, that's not enough for, for something like that and honestly I'm looking forward to to the World Cup and I hope that the coach is going to invite me so we will see Niklas Heising noch mal von der Bild Yeah I want to ask you about your uh, position because um, at the European Championships you played all the games as a left back. Um, when you read on the internet, everybody describes you as a centre back. You already spoke about your your, uh, your days in Zagreb where you played centre back. So, uh, do you have a favourite position? And has Jesse Marsh already spoken you, uh, with you about that? Well, if you know, my favourite position is a striker. So, <laughs> <laughs> but it's not possible to play. It. <laughs> we never know. Yeah. Uh, well, uh, honestly, my favorite position is the central back, yeah, but there is no time to to, to talk about it. Wherever coach puts me, uh, I'm going to to do my best, and yeah, that's all what I can say about it. Oliver Hartmann from Kicker. Uh, during the last season, you watched all the matches of RB Leipzig, and yes? <laughs> I don't want to lie to you, but uh, maybe most of it, I would say like that, because when I play, when I played with the Dinamo Zagreb, you guys also, actually, you guys also had a match, so it was a little bit difficult to, to watch in the, in the same time, you know. What do you think about the style Leipzig is playing? Uh, well, uh, I like it a lot. This is the one reason why I, why I signed for for that club. Uh, they are playing actually we because now I'm the part of this team. We are playing very offensive, uh, so yeah. I, I, as I said, I need uh, some extra time to 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 adapt for that because it's not easy to to play like this for a 19 minutes, and we will see. Yeah. Martin. Josko, uh, normally um, um, young professionals have uh, idols, um, players from the past, um, they put posters at the wall. Um, who was it uh, um, for you, uh, if? And um, the second is, uh, are there any uh, players in particular um, within your new squad who help you um, get orientation uh, within the team, within the club, uh, and within um, uh, your um, role as a player, like for yeah, example, Billy Orban or s someone who gives you, who helps you out. Yeah, all right. And the second, in the team, yeah, with the teammates, yeah. Well, the first question is: my favorite player was uh, Messi. <laughs> I don't want to lie to you. <laughs> And as a defender, any anyone you admire? A defender. As a defender. Yeah. Uh, Ramos. How do you say here? Yeah. Ramos. Yeah, we know. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe Ramos. <laughs> I don't know. No, Ramos. It's perfect. It's perfect. All right. And the second question was uh, about uh, some. Which, which player of the new squad right now gives you helps you to um, to um, to get along uh, with all the new um, um, input um, you get from the team. Um, Someone who helps you out to um, on a social level, 
to be your let's you know uh, telling you what it works how it works uh, what's to do and um Who and second on the uh, yeah, yeah, in the team yeah in the team well uh, maybe there's a captain or you know some lucky samardzic lazar mm -hmm. okay because uh, we speak the same language so oh, okay right yeah okay and um, so i would say him yeah one more question do you really did you uh, start as a young kid as a striker or were you uh, always a defender i started with a uh, left back then the coach uh, changed my position to a striker and then i finished with uh, right winger and then okay so you moved you, you moved all yeah, positions everything except uh, goalkeeper okay <laughs> but so it, it was a, it was a joke that you uh, dreamt no, of uh, being a striker that's that not, a, not joke, a joke yeah okay <laughs> thanks <laughs> Gibt es noch weitere Fragen? Das ist erstmal nicht der Fall. Dann haben wir noch ein paar Fanfragen, die der nette Kollege Daniel Langstädter einreichen wird. There are some questions from the fans. All right. Uh, yes, we collected some questions from the fans. Yeah. So a welcome from the fans as well. They're really happy to see you. Uh, you mentioned Dani Omo uh, earlier. The fans want to know how close are you to and do you miss him here in the training camp? Yeah, hi to the fans. Yeah, I miss I miss him a lot. To be honest, uh, well, uh, what was the question? I don't remember. Like, do you, how close? How how is your relationship? How close? Uh, yeah. yeah. How close are you to? Him a friend. Yeah. Well, before before he 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 left the Dynamo, uh, I came to to the first team, and we spent maybe uh, six months together. So. We can say that we are closest friends, so but but you know there there's gonna be enough time to to make the relationship better, yeah, and that's all. But I remember when uh, you first came came to Leipzig, yeah, and did a tour of the training facility. I think yeah, he was he, there too. He, huh? he, he was showed there you too, around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Another question uh, you mentioned, or you were asked about your German skills so far. The fans want to know: Did you learn? A word or maybe a sentence in German already that you want to try as well. Of course, I want to try. So, can I start with uh, "Ich heiße Joschko"? Is that okay? Yeah, perfect. Okay. perfect. And uh, "Ich spiele Fußball für". Für? Yeah. Für? Für? How do you say? <laughs> Red Bull Leipzig. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And something else. <laughs> uh, I've been uh, 19 years old. Is that okay? Yeah. Yeah, perfect. Do you understand? Yeah. Yeah, sure. Right. Yeah. Keep going. <laughs> Pre pretty good. Pretty impressive. <laughs> uh, to be honest, it's not easy. Yeah. <laughs> but you're doing really good. Yeah. Maybe a good question, if no one else has a question, to end uh, the, the round here. Uh, a fan wanted you to show off your Croatian skills and say the fan cheer of our RB Leipzig fans. They always cheer, Einmal Leipzig, Immer Leipzig. In English, it's once Leipzig, always Leipzig. Maybe you could say that in Croatian. Uh, Once Leipzig, uh, always Leipzig. Creation, yeah. 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 Jednom Leipzig, uvijek Leipzig. <laughs> yeah. Thank you from the fans. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome, das guys. Das war doch ein schönes Ende. Vielen Dank für euer Interesse und die fröhliche Runde. Ich würde sagen, wir machen noch das obligatorische Foto mit dem Trikot im Anschluss und wünsche euch allen einen schönen Tag. Nice.